to show you guys, you know, a little bit of what I'm rocking, you know what I'm saying? And I always got my crosses on. Just to see, I forgot how good these fit actually with the with the gun itself. Finesse gang, back for another one. Yo, but look, before I get into this video, I just wanna say thank you for all the love and support everybody has been giving me. I appreciate you guys tuning in. I appreciate you guys giving me feedback and all the subscriptions and everything for every video. I just wanna say, I appreciate it. I'm only maybe like, what, two months into this YouTube stuff and I think we're off to a good start. So once again, I appreciate it. Thank you guys. Keep tuning in, keep subscribing and we're gonna film way more content, all right? So look, I got a new gun bag. Um, obviously Glock, because I do love Glock. I love all brands, I love all guns, but Glock is probably one of my favorites, so I decided to get a Glock bag. My other bag was no good. <laughs> that thing was a little small little bag, it did me justice, but it was no good. So I upgraded, all right? We got the new Glock bag, it's awesome, has a lot of different compartments, and I'm gonna show you what's inside, what I usually carry. Just going to the range and stuff, not all my stuff. A lot of my stuff I keep in my gun room, but as of now, I'll show you what I have in my gun bag and we'll go through it together, all right? Let's go. As you can see right off the rip, we got Glock Perfection. I think it's a really cool bag. It's got a lot of different stuff on the outside. We'll start over here. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six different compartments for magazines, it looks like. Um, that's kind of one thing I kind of don't really like 100%. I probably wouldn't, I don't know why, but I don't like my magazines on the outside of the bag. I'd rather it on the inside. But it's cool. It's cool. It'll do. All right. Now, let's start on the other side. What do I got here? We got the actual gun lock itself. I just kept it in here. I got my eyes. Keep them in here. Probably could put some other stuff in there, but I found that a good spot for my eyes. Let's see what we got in here. Got some ears. Uh barrel cleaning just in case something happens at the range got some other little cleaning stuff some rubber bands some tape and that reminds me i have to actually get some black tape some hockey tape i think for the grip i want to get something like that uh what do we got in here silver sharpie mark all my mags i think it's a i'll show you what i do for my mags put a little dot at the bottom of it, so I know they're mine, they don't get lost at the range. This is for my TLR when I'm shooting. If it does happen to get a little loose, tighten it up, keep that in there. And when we get to the mags, I will show you guys exactly what I mean. All right, now, for the main part, let's see. Let's put this back up a little bit so it's out of the way. All right. Now, got a whole bunch of range ammo whole bunch of range ammo let's see got 100 there 200 300 and a couple hollows just for the hell of it these are some of my favorite bullets in the world i love them the barnes tech xpds and also the critical defense these have Pink tips. Bet you never seen these before, huh? The critical defense with the pink tip. Let's see if I can get one out for you guys. Pink tip. I think that was pretty cool. Put that back. I think it's for breast cancer awareness or something like that. So that was cool. Now I also have gloves. 
just regular Adidas gloves, but I think they're pretty cool sometimes. They fit nice and tight, so able to get your hand around the gun and has no problem with the trigger guard or anything. The big boy, 50 round drum. I always keep this in here just in case, you know, I'm having one of those days, one of those fun days where I want to load it up and just mag dump it. So I always keep this in here too. Big, big 50 drum. Now, just for the sake of the video, I have my gun in here, 43X, TLR, and uh, it's usually always on my hip or in the house somewhere at arm's reach. But like I said, just for the sake of the video, I keep it in there because once in a while I will throw it in there. I have some hollows in here as of right now. It's always loaded. But we're safe. And we got some extra magazines in this compartment. And here is my newest addition to my magazine is my Plus 2 by Hive Technologies. It works great. I already put probably about 200, 300 rounds to it. It's awesome. I know about the Shield Arm mags, 15 rounds. But you know what? I'm always going to stick with OEM, so I just added a plus two, 12 rounds. I think that's plenty enough. If you can't get the job done in 12 rounds, I don't know. You got to go back to the drawing board. So, oh yeah, for the Sharpie, all my magazines, as you can see, I put a little dot at the bottom. So I always know they're mine. I won't get them mixed up at the range or loss. Sometimes, you know, I'm doing mag reloads and... Stuff is dropping to the floor. You never know. So as of right now, including also the drum, this is kind of all I got in the bag as of right now. Because like I said, everything else is in my gun room itself. And, you know, just my miscellaneous stuff that I usually go to the um, range with. You know, I'll just keep in the bag. Yeah, here's the... Uh, um, coin I like to keep in there just to tighten that up in case it does get a little loose when I'm shooting it. And um, yeah, I usually keep about, you know, what do we got? One, two, three hundred, about three and change, three hundred and change rounds in the bag. Just regular range rounds, nothing too crazy. Keep my magazines. Usually I don't keep my gun in there. It's usually in the house, like I said, next to me. But like I said, for the video, I put it in the bag because... You know, when I travel, sometimes I do put it in there, whatever, whatever. And yeah, guys, overall, that's what we're working with as of right now. Until I get, you know, some other stuff from my gun and my necessities, this is what I'm keeping in my bag. So, you know, leave in the comments what you guys think that I should have more of. You know, maybe what you guys keep in your gun bags and stuff like that. Am I missing something? I don't know. But I think it's pretty cool has one, two, three, four big pockets, a big layer down here. You can fit a whole bunch of stuff. And I actually do love the top like this with the with the double zippers. I thought that was a cool addition. And we're rocking like that, guys. Magazines in the back, right? And it's not bad. And it was only like $35, so nothing crazy, you know? And it's big enough to keep all my stuff, which I think I have a decent amount of stuff for now, you know? And it's only going to grow. I'm only going to get more guns. I'm only going to get more ammo. I'm only going to get more little, you know, mods and little stuff like that. So I thought that was a good little addition that I got as of right now. Like I said, if you guys have anything else that you think I should be rocking or you guys have some other stuff that I don't have, you know, comment down below. Let me know. Let me know what's going down. Let me know what you guys got. Okay, guys. Well, I decided to put my gloves on. All right. <laughs> Just to see. I forgot how good these fit actually with the, with the gun itself. They're really cool. They're really nice. And they're just regular Adidas baseball gloves. But anyway, um, 
This is what, this is my bag. This is usually what I have in my bag, all my ammo. As you can see, all my stuff here. And uh, yeah, actually, before I go, I see in the comments a lot that people are always saying, yo, do you have a diamond tooth? I see something on your teeth, blah, blah, blah. What is it? All right, so yeah, guys, look, this is what I As got. you can see, guys, yes, I do have a diamond tooth. It's one tooth and I've had it for many years now. And uh, people do notice, people ask. So I just want to show you guys, you know, a little bit of what I'm rocking, you know what I'm saying? And I always got my crosses on, got my diamond crosses on. And yes, I have a diamond tooth. So if you do always see something funny in my mouth, it's, uh, it's that. All right. <laughs> you guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Like I said before, if I'm missing anything or you think I should add something to the range bag, leave a comment. Give me a shout. Let me know what's going down. All right. I appreciate you guys for stopping in and stay tuned. All right. A lot more content to come. I'll see you guys in the next trip. Peace, y'all.